Hi, my name is Brian Thompson. I am the community manager here at BYU-Idaho. This is Laura DeFiori. She works in the Faculty Technology Center here on campus. In this tutorial, we will be demonstrating the new enhancements made on the student and teacher dashboards on iLearn. The teacher dashboard in the new iLearn is similar to the teacher dashboard in the classic iLearn. Here you will see a list of your active and current courses. To view your inactive and courses from previous semesters, select the drop-down menu, view all courses, and you will see a list of all courses here. You can organize them by course, role, term, status, start date, and end date. If you go back to the drop-down menu, you will see that there's a button here that takes you directly to the course management tool. The Learn More button will take you to the iLearn community. Underneath courses are announcements. For any unread announcements, there will appear an orange megaphone icon indicating that it has not been read. If you go to the drop down menu under announcements, you have the option to view all announcements preferences, which we will talk about later, and again, learn more. To the right is the ION iLearn. Here, there will be the latest updates on iLearn. A new feature in the new iLearn is that you have the option to collapse the boxes. For faculty, the option to the author dashboard is available which eliminates the need to grade column here at the left. Go to Dashboards, Author Dashboard, and you can see that it disappears. These are the new features and improvements to iLearn. For questions or concerns, students can call the Help Desk at 208 496-9000 and teachers can contact the Faculty Technology Center at extension 7230. Thank you.